test one too. All right, so in this video, we're gonna be working on frequently asked questions. So this company requested a site with a FAQ page. So the customer sent me the files in a Word document. And so we're gonna go from there. So this is gonna be an example scenario. Alright, so we're going to open it up in Google Docs. Alright, so... So I'm going to first add a new page because um, the way this is going to be structured is there's going to be one main page for let's call it the menu that's going to have all the questions and the other page is going to have it's basically going to have all the content from the questions meaning the title is essentially going to be a hyperlink and then the answer is going to be on a separate page so in total Yes, hello, this is Nick. Hello? Yes, hello? Alright, back at it. Alright, so... Where were we? Alright, so... Let's take a look. Alright, so back to... Right, let's get back to work on it. So, what I'm going to start off is copying the title so we're gonna make this one the main page so we pasted this question so this is gonna be the first question on there if we publish it, I'll show you what it looks like. So this is what it looks like currently. So let's add the rest of these questions. All right, so for the purpose of this example, we've added all the questions that we're gonna have. Um, the company that I'm working with is actually gonna have much more, but for this example, we're gonna stick with these five. Uh, so now let's add. So I've already added a page previously because I was already working on this, but you guys, you know, you'd normally add a new page with this title. Let's say 
this would be the question. But I should already have one here. Alright, so we had one the same. All right, so now I've created the web page and we're gonna link it back to the original menu page. And so this would be the URL. You're gonna copy it. All right, so now I'm gonna go here, click on this link icon, paste the URL, or the other way of doing it is you can search the page here and it should be able to find it. But you see what happened there? That link kind of went in the middle and ruined it, so. Make sure to Okay, so now it should be linked together and it can function and now you just have to build out the rest of the pages. So now this one is a hyperlink. And now it goes over to the actual page. So yeah, that's sort of um, the design process for a really simple frequently asked pen, uh, questions page. The other way is to do a drop down menu like this, which if you guys are interested, I can cover that in the tutorial too. So yeah. Uh, that's the basic premise behind it. Yeah.